<coughs> yeah, I'm laying here. I have fallen nodded off. And uh, I'm laying here. And I'm hearing, I look out the window and I realize, I thought Jeremiah was gone. But that's his car sitting out front. So he's here. Uh, he's he's asleep. Um, so, <sighs> I'm laying here and I hear this, first I hear this noise like, I don't know what was going on. Uh, like somebody was running metal down the street or something. And I, I think it was a, a, a Mexican family maybe, I'm not sure. Uh, with the kid in the little, you know, the little car. Um, so that's what I was hearing at first. Then I look out the window, there's a shopping cart out here. So somebody also had a shopping cart was rolling it. That's the noise that I was hearing. So I was like, okay. And then I lay back down. And then I hear, you know, like a car just hit another car. I immediately pop up because my car is right across out front right there where it's always an accident and Jeremiah's car is right out front so I look out the window and sure enough <laughs> somebody in a black car like a, a small black SUV um, I guess was backing up or out and hit this little gray car across from me right now I'm sitting there and I'm watching because I wasn't sure at first I'm just looking I'm like okay I'm trying to see is if this little SUV is coming out of the building across from us because they have a um you know like a, a driveway where you can pull up and park your car up you don't have to park your car on the street so I'm thinking maybe somebody was backing out and came out too far and hit that car um I'm not sure actually what happened that's just how it appeared and so I'm looking and I see the person mind you I got my contacts in so I cannot see clearly so I see the person stop the car get out the car go look behind at their car I don't know if they looked at the car that they hit but definitely looked at the back of their car then got back in the car and sat there for a minute now here's the thing because I'm sitting in the window. I just happen to be in the window with the screen up because I'm trying to see clear. Because there's also a car right behind mine that was had the lights on. And I'm thinking, okay, did, was it my car just got popped? You know, I'm trying to see. And uh, so the person then, I guess, realizes that I'm looking at them uh, or in that direction. That person gets out of the car waits until traffic go by and then comes across the street like if maybe they were going to come to say something to me or something but instead stands right in front of the window there you know right across it was like <sighs> you know I couldn't tell if they was maybe a little tipsy or was like oh my god I just hit this car or maybe they thought it was my car I don't know they were like <sighs> looked up and then looked back down and looked over at the car never said a word Looked over at the car and at that point I shut my window <laughs> and I was sitting here and I'm like, hmm, I wonder if they're going to write a note and let that car know, hey, I just hit your car, you know, and they hit it hard enough for me to look out the window. It sounded like something was um cracked. You know what I'm saying? Um definitely there's a dent. There's definitely a dent. And, you know, I, like I said, I, I I'm not sure if the person in that car lives in this building or in the building across the way. I can't even tell if it was a man or a woman. I, I really can't. I, I think it was a man. A little, a little petite person. Yeah, I don't see no note on that person's car and it pulled off. So they probably thought maybe it was my car and I was in the window watching or something. But I guess they felt like, well, if it ain't her car, let me go on and pull off. You know, but I think it would have been only fair to 
put a note on that person's car. Hey, I just hit your car. You know, but I don't know. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I could, I could be wrong. Maybe they hit something else. But I'm pretty sure that car backed into that other car. Uh, I'm, I'm sure of it. But that's just ridiculous. It's just, I don't know what it is about Washington. I, I just don't know. It's just always something. Anyway, guys, I'm going to lay back down. I'm tired. And I'm sitting here with an urge to have. Something sweet. And I'm fighting it because, one, there is nothing in there sweet. Which means I would have to get up and go to the store, which I'm not going to do. And now that I think of it, I think there's um, one left. I can't, I don't do the applesauce. I saved that. I'm saving that for Lavelle. He seems to like it. <laughs> he loves applesauce. I didn't know he ate applesauce like that. I think I mentioned it to y'all last time. Okay. All right. Uh, strawberry. Keep frozen. This is the last one. <clears throat> I'll leave it out for a moment to... Uh, do I still got my water in there? Yeah, I do have a little bit of water. I'm going to leave it out for a moment to uh, unthaw a bit. Instead of an orange, I have the little cuties. Okay. Hopefully they're sweet. But I know this is a strawberry cup. So really good. I think the next time I go shopping, I'll probably get little things like that because it's healthy and it's quick. You know, definitely get a few more microwavable things pieces and stuff like that because I'm tired of cooking. I really am. I try to cook to so that stuff can last and stretch. Um but I run out of ideas. One, two and not even so much that I run out of ideas, I just get tired of cooking sometimes. Even though it is something that I absolutely positively love to do. Um there's some new not some new, but there's some ideas that I want to try uh, coming up here soon. Like I told y'all, uh, Anthony of Van Life did a um, stuff. Hey, chop chop! Yum yum! Yum yum! Yum yum! <laughs> I love the fact that he knows his name. <laughs> when I do that, he just be like, "What you talking? What you talking?" Meow 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 Say hello to the people. Say hello to YouTube. Hmm? <laughs> I don't know why he feels he has to always smell my nose. He has to always get up on me like, I don't know. I go checking to see if I'm still alive or if I'm alive, right? <laughs> Ooh. I wasn't the only one that saw him. The lady is out there. She like, did you hit my? Do y'all hear? Did you hit my car? I was told you hit my car. I didn't say that. <laughs> I didn't even know who car it is. Wow, so that's a lady's car, and I think she lives in this building because I've seen that car before uh, many times. 
So he, he must have decided to park his car somewhere else. And it's funny, you, you think he would have thought that, I'm, you know, maybe I'm not the only one that saw you, dude? Wow. That's crazy. Oh, my God. This is really good. It's really sweet. But it's cold. I heard him say no. It's like I was told you hit my car. I could even tell her who it was. I just knew it was a black. At least it looked black. It looked like a black, a little black SUV. And it definitely was. Obviously, a man, so somebody else seen him too. Looked in, guy. Almost like he had a uniform on. Maybe that's what it was. Maybe he was just tired. This is so good. But it's frozen. Anyway, guys, that's the one thing, too, I hate about being on this street with my light is on <coughs> and my shades are up. Right now, I even got the window up because I'm hot. And so, people tend to, when they get locked out or whatever, they always push in my bill. Anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Have a great night. I'm going to go back to sleep. I'm tired. I'm going to wait for my stuff to unfreeze, unthaw, and wait for my little cutie to warm up. And then I'm going to bed. I'm, I'm just going to sleep. And I have to say, if that, if, if somebody, not, if that young lady not saw my daughter ask me, I am not gonna lie, you know, because I wouldn't, I would want someone to do the same for me, you know, dude, you, I mean, come on, that's, it, things happen, you can work something out, you know what I'm saying, but, especially if it's not, if it's just a little dent, but I'm, I don't think it's a little dent, because it was loud enough for me to be like, you know, jump up, like, Okay, somebody just hit some, some, <laughs> you know, because I'm hearing, you know how you hear that kind of that metal, you know, like something just got bent. That was that type of sound. So if she asks, I will have to be honest. I can't tell you, you know, I couldn't make out a face because it's night. I can't see. I cannot make out a face. Um, I can only say that it, it did appear like it was it was a male figure may have had a uniform on i'm not sure definitely all black whatever the outfit was was dark um uh, yeah and it was a i'm sure the car is, the color was black even it yeah it can't be a dark dark blue jeremiah's car is a dark blue but if it's even darker than that, it could appear black. But I don't know. Anyway. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, You finna get in the window? Meow, meow. You gonna get in the window? No? Because I'm talking to you, you change your mind. <laughs> you change your mind. Did that what did? Don't be stupid. Oh. oh, you changed your mind. Say hello, people. See why she just gotta put me in this dog on camera, huh? Why can't she just hold me and show me some affection without putting me in the camera? 
why do I have to be in the <laughs> camera? <laughs> anyway, guys, have a great night, okay? Bye. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <coughs> Hello, everybody. Good morning. <coughs> it is Thursday, Friday Eve. It is December 21st, Vlogmas Day 21, the last of my cream. <laughs> I'm gonna put it ready here, making my coffee. <coughs> Happy Thursday. Hey. Ho. Hey. Ho. Happy Thursday. Good morning, everybody. How are you? Hope everybody is doing well. I uh, trust that you all slept well. It's a beautiful day. Beautiful morning. I don't know what the temperature is yet. But the fact that the Lord has saw fit to allow me to see another day clothed, sheltered, and in my right mind a job, food transportation it's a beautiful day, I'm grateful I cannot complain you know <clears throat> whether things go the way I want or whatever I can't complain. I can't complain. Y'all, I'm standing here talking to y'all and I'm listening to the radiator in the living room. That mug is hot. I feel the heat and I'm hearing it. I gotta turn it down. <laughs> I just, I, it's hot. Jesus. You hear somebody walking out back? Is that, is that Jeremiah? That chair am I about to come up the stairs, chop. Alexa, what's the temperature today? Good morning, Ka Sheena. Ka right Sheena. Now, it's 41 degrees Fahrenheit. Today, expect a high of 44 degrees. A high of 44 degrees. Somebody back there and they sing it. That ain't Jeremiah. <laughs> or unless he's talking, maybe it sounds like he's singing. Almost done, guys. Almost done. had any weird dreams lately any dreams at all really I, I feel like I did maybe but that yeah, wasn't here but I don't remember anything so all right guys my coffee is made my kitchen is clean. Cleaned it up last night. I just got up this morning and um, washed a few dishes. Well, just a uh, a pot and a plate, and that's it. Living room is clean. Hallway smell good, clean. Bathroom smell good, clean. Everything smell good and clean. I'm so happy about that. Coffee is done. I'm real hungry this morning. But I know once I get that coffee in me, I'll be good. And I definitely have to, after this cup, this first and only cup, um, I'll be 
Nothing but water. Nothing but water. Let's see. Sorry about that, you guys. Let me just turn this. So, you gotta be water, water, water. Gotta get that intake. Um, because I don't want no issues. I wanna be able to get in, get out. You know, um, I'm a little sleepy, yes. I went to bed early. I was so tired yesterday. I went to bed early. Um, but I didn't necessarily go to sleep early. And a couple of times I did nod off. I was back up, you know, it was catnapping, catnapping. So I'm a little tired. My eyes and things are a little tired, as y'all can see. The left one looks a little swole, <laughs> you know, just a little chunky everywhere. Um, I'm like a 192, so I've gained a lot um, since that pregnant zone. I've, I've gained a lot. So um, it is what it is. I'm not going to worry about it. Um, I will get it off in due time. Um, it's 7.13 guys, so I'm going to go ahead here and log in for work and talk to you guys maybe later in the day. I am completely dressed aside from my bottom. I have on shorts, so I will put on pants a little bit later in the day. Uh, right now, I prefer to be comfortable, as comfortable as possible. Um, today is the 21st, so Lord is me again. Um, and actually, I didn't talk, I didn't read yesterday to you guys. So yesterday was the 20th, was hope. Today is the 21st, I want to know you. Now, it's the 7.13. Let's, let's try to get both in, but if not, we'll definitely get the one from yesterday in. Hope. Why, my soul, are you downcast? Why, my soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my Savior and my God. As a child, you might recall a time when you longed to have a certain new toy and hoped with all your heart Santa would come through. You know the pain of disappointment if it wasn't under the tree, and also the joy if it was. People everywhere are looking for someone or something to put their hope in while unaware that the greatest source of hope is found in Jesus Christ. What are you hoping for today? I can go on and on. <laughs> you are hoping. You are hoping a key person in your life or your circumstances will change. Fulfillment of such a hope cannot be granted. I mean, guaranteed. However, when we place our hope in Christ, then every longing we have will be fulfilled. God knows what we really need, and he does. So he may have to squeak our longings a bit to fit his plan. But when our hope and trust are directed toward the, toward the God of all hope, we will not be disappointed. Lord, confirm, conform the longings of my heart, all my hopes to the mold you have fashioned for me. My hope is in you, and I will wait. I know that all my desires are known to you, and you give what I really need. Amen. Amen. And he does. Yes. Amen. Amen to that. Amen. Put your hope in God. Put your hope in God. There is nothing that we need or want according to his will that he will not provide. I want to know you. Oh, that we might know the Lord. Let us press on to know him. He will respond to us as surely as the arrival of dawn or the coming of rains in early spring. Hosea, what a prophet with a most unusual assignment. He was led to marry a prostitute as a picture of Israel's unfaithfulness to God. 
in seeking to restore his own adulterous wife, Hosea um, dis demonstrated God's love and desire to restore his chosen people. The Israelites had turned to other gods, trusting in their own strength and military power rather than in the Lord. God allowed much tragedy to befall them in order to persuade them to return to him. Under these very heartbreaking circumstances, Hosea's impassioned plea um, reaches our ears today. Let us press on to know him. Have you been wayward lately? Perhaps trusting in other people or in your own wisdom to solve your everyday problems. Have you made activities or businesses or even ministries your priority, your priority and re relegated God to the back shelf? Oh, let us press on to know him. He will respond to us as surely as the arrival of dawn. As we seek him, he will reciprocate as surely as the coming of rains in early spring. Lord, increase my desire to know you. I want to press on greater. I want to press on to greater knowledge of you. But life so often gets in the way. Today I resolve to seek you first. In Jesus' name, yes. Yes, we all do it. We all do it. We all do it. We're all doing it. We're all looking for turning to our own uh, minds and hearts and whatever and other people to try to solve matters that we need to give to God and trust him and let him do what he do I want to say it's just that simple but it's not it's not for, it's hard it's easier much easier said than done much easier said than done you know because we are flesh and we feed our flesh more and I say it all the time. Uh, Y'all, let me go ahead and get started. I hope that was a blessing to some of you. Because it is definitely a blessing to me. It may not sound like it, but it truly is. Um, just about everything I read hits home. Presses a, or or um, it, it, it hits a topic that I've either dealt with or dealing with. You know, um, So hopefully it, it helps You know, some of you. I truly hope so. Um, but guys, I'm going to go ahead and talk to you later. I got to go ahead and finish getting set up here. Um, and I'm sorry I talk a little funny, but I put the tongue back in my tongue ring back in. And it's just, it's taking a little bit to get back used to it. And I think the thing is a little long. Not as long as Kiana's. But long. Oh, Lord. That's so good, but it needs some more sugar. Some more sweet. Y'all, I'm going to talk to you later. You guys have an amazing Thursday morning. Remember to say your prayers. Not just for your family, friends, and loved ones, but all our brothers and all our sisters in Christ. Remember to treat people the way you would expect to be treated. Better yet, the way the Lord would. And um, expect great things, guys, to happen to you, through you, and for you, okay? Um, you guys have an amazing day. And I'll talk to you later. Bye. Hey guys, it is 6.22, December 21st, uh, 6.22 p.m. I'm just getting in. I went to donate. I got off work a little earlier. I went to donate. Um, and from there, I went to the store. And now I'm home. I'm broke again. <laughs> but it's okay. I had to get what I had to get. Um, so let me show y'all what I had, what I got. I got this pan. Uh, with the lid that comes with it. That, this will be for the devil eggs. This pan is for the um, barbecue baked chicken that I'm going to make. Uh, I got the sweet brown sugar barbecue sauce. Honey barbecue sauce. Relish. Salt. Totally out of salt. And what is this? Some glue. This is from a fireplace. Uh, I got oh, this is my water bottle. I'm gonna fill it back up, put it in the freezer. 
chicken broth hair color gonna dye the snow black okay get back in the freezer and then two cartons of eggs whipped cream one loaf of bread Like a barbecue chip. Medium and mild cheddar. And a pack two packs of chicken thighs. All right. Uh oh, don't want to shut. I didn't want to shut. <laughs> okay, let's put this here. This stuff we'll just put here for now. Refrigerator. Dropping stuff. <sighs> I'm going to make myself really quick. Woo! Little hot. <laughs> make day of some turkey. I'm going to make myself a uh, cheese toast. guys how was you guys day i hope y'all had an amazing day today i really do maybe i just make myself a mm -hmm. Hot dog with you. I have to get ketchup. I think maybe I'll make myself a hot dog. Make his sandwich for work. Yeah, so guys, how did your day go? I, I, my day went by pretty fast. Pretty okay. Just a little tired, a little hot. Ready to get out of everything, take everything off. A lot on the brain.
crazy cat. Oh y'all, <laughs> I'm telling y'all, we want to choke Choco. Most time I can't catch him doing what he's doing. Oh, what these days? I'm gonna get him. I have enough aluminum. Okay, what am I trying to do? I'm sorry guys, I really hope you had an amazing day today. I just got a lot on my mind, but... Definitely want you all to have had a great day. That is good. Go ahead, put you over there. You over there. You over there. I'm about to open up another Oh, so you want here. I think for me, I'm gonna have a cheese dog. The soda would be nice. Some acid. My stove. It's so annoying the fact that it, it dips like that. This is gonna be a messy but good sandwich, y'all. I need to wash my hands already, by the way. I was watching Anthony earlier. He was talking about how I wanted his subscribers to mention that what they say he didn't wash his hands when he washed his hands with just water, no soap, and then has in order to dry his hands off with a dirty towel. <laughs> So he bought, he, when he went to the grocery shop, he bought soap and stuff. After I found the soap. Oh, that was so funny. He was like, so I bought me some. He was like, <laughs> I was like, Lord, have mercy. Like, so I bought some soap.
gonna say I can't find the top to the bowl. Y'all can't see that I'm doing. I'm sorry. I saw, I saw. Like it should be Friday, but it's not. And I should open that window. <sighs> I got a flyer when I went to the store. I just see what all they had. Anyway guys, I just wanted to check in, see how you guys were doing this evening, see how your day went. Um 
wish you guys a wonderful rest of the evening um, I'm pretty tired I really am so I'm just gonna oh and I got some contact lenses today I went and bought some contact lenses I didn't have a choice I have to be able to see um, so yeah now my funds are gone now my funds are gone Y'all know I just love me some Megan Good. I think she's so beautiful. I really do. Anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Enjoy your evening. Remember to say your prayers. Remember to treat people right. And expect great things to happen to you, through you, and for you. Talk to you guys later. Bye.